I'm Amy Grills, this is my husband Scott Grills. We bought the farm from Scott's mom and dad, George and Gail, back in 2014. They bought, purchased the farm back in 1972. This is actually a third generation farm. We raised our three kids there. They've all been active on the farm since we've actually bought the farm. And even beforehand, uh, my father-in-law's health had deteriorated four to five years before we bought the farm. So the kids have always had to actually help out and do things with everything so yeah. mm -hmm. now they're starting to go on their own way but since we've built the farm we're hoping maybe one of them will someday want to come back to the farm In 2015-2016, Scott and I realized that we had to make some changes around the barn. We were in an old Thai style barn and we decided that we either had three options. We could either build new, we could go with um, putting more money into our old barn, which in general you're still going to continue putting more money into or getting up. But since Scott's passion is actually farming, we knew that wasn't an option so we decided to build a new barn. So then when we went to build at first, as everyone knows, we looked at several different kinds of barns, different styles. We looked at the Geo Parlor systems, but after looking at the Geo Robot, robots were coming, seemed to be the way, hard to find people to work if our mm -hmm. children don't want to help. So we decided that after several meetings with Troy, that it was time to actually mm -hmm. go with the robot and move forward from there. Yeah. I'm not getting any younger and you know, it's just a lot easier on my body and I like the, the fact that I have more freedom. We chose a Gia mounting robot. We went and toured barns and different types of robots. At the end of the day, I really like the fact that everything was done inside the liner. It was quick and efficiently, attaches really fast. I couldn't have asked for a better choice, but that's one of the biggest reasons. My dad and I, we've always been with Gia, so it was an easy choice to make for me, and that's basically why I chose, and we have a really good rapport with uh, my dealer, so yeah. Uh, Scott and George were always with Woods Dairy Source. They've always been there for us. Troy was the first person that we called when we decided to go with a new build. We looked at different ones, guided us through. He's been there through everything with us. My father was with Woods Dairy. It's been very well serviced. We've had a good rapport with Woods Dairy. They have uh, been there when I needed them. They're help service, you know, because I had an old barn and an old pipeline. They did a great job keeping it running at peak capacity and I couldn't ask for a better team. When we first moved in, they were here for us and they did everything. I don't think I might have got the first day or so. It was pretty tough because my dad had passed away just prior of moving into the new barn. I couldn't have asked for a better team because uh, they were there for give us, you know, if I, a couple days, I was really under stress and they said go and just we'll look after and they looked after the barn and I couldn't ask for a better transition and just super unbelievable.